Hey guys, it's Lindsay. Um, I know I haven't made a video in a while, and I apologize for that, but I've been on vacation and stuff, and yeah, this video is going to be a vacation haul, and let me know if you guys like my setting right now, because the lighting is much better here than it is in my room, like, honestly, it's so much better, but yeah, it's going to be a haul of what I got on vacation, and if you like my makeup, I'll do a routine if you want to, so I go back to school look, okay, so, the first thing I got is this bag. I went to Lake George in New York. And it's this bag. It's at one of those like really cheap stores where you can just get a bag. But I really wanted one for the whole vacation that I could just carry everything around in that I needed. Because my phone is the size of like, it's like that big. I'm filming on right now. Oh yeah, and that, if, um... Probably notice I'm filming on my phone because my camera broke. Yeah, well, like it turns on and the batteries are fully charged. I charge them. It turns on and then the middle of the video it'll just turn off and it gets really annoying. And I tried to film this on my camera before, but it didn't work. So they're not edited or anything. Sorry about that. So yeah, I got this bag. This was. I'll tell you the prices. This was 20 I think. Yeah, this was 20 Okay, and then I bought... I always buy these. It's like a tradition. I have to buy one of these. It's like Sailor's Knot Bracelet. And yeah, this was on sale for a dollar. Usually two dollars. I don't wear them that much, but I get one every year. So I thought I'd go with that tradition. You can like see my kitchen in the background. Dining room. Okay. And for clothes... I have so many sweatshirts, so I decided I didn't need any sweatshirts. So I got this, like, oversized shirt, because I wear my shirts really big, because it's for bed and stuff. So it's like George, New York, 1903, and then it says the same exact thing on the sleeve. It's backwards, because, you know, it's a camera. I'm using the front camera, because the back camera is annoying. Because, literally, let me show you what you're sitting on right now. You are literally sitting on that right there. And that's like the outside. You're literally sitting right here. Yeah. Okay, so I got these sweatpants, which are also too big because I also always overestimate my size. So when I buy things, I always buy them too big. You can see they're huge. And then they're, they're black and they just said like George on the leg. Yeah. Those are cute. And then most of the money I oh the shirt was fifteen all oh, fifteen and the sweatpants were like twenty I think. So the rest of the stuff that I have is like beauty and stuff because that's what I spent most of my money there on. <laughs> Cause my dad gave me a certain amount of money. Well, I took it out of my bank account, but he'd only let me take out a certain amount of money, and then I'd spend that all, and somebody's going by. Hope they're not going in here. Okay, so before the vacation, I bought this so I could have it for the vacation. It's just like, it's from Claire's. It was like eight fifty, I think, or five fifty. The headband was eight fifty, and I. On vacation, I would just, like, put my hair up, like, after I got out of the pool and stuff, because I didn't, it was, like, my hair was wet like it is now. I just took a shower. But it was all wet, and I really did not want to, like, do anything with it. Because this whole summer, I'm doing no heat, no dye, which is hard, because this is not my natural hair color. But I dye my hair a lot. It's a problem. But, so I bought this, and I'd put it in, like, a bun, and then it'd be, like, like a sock bun, and it'd be, like, around it. It looked really cute. And it's just, like, cream and floral. Yeah. Okay. So now, on to the beauty. I'm gonna show you what I bought before. Because, before vacation, I was running out of... Oh, there's a bee. It's outside. I was running out of foundation, so I had to buy one so I would have one on the trip. And the concealer that I have doesn't work that well. It's like the e.l.f. Complete Coverage Concealer, and it's like the, like, where it comes with four different colors. And none of them really match me. They're, like, 
off by a little bit, everyone. I hate when people go by. So I bought this CoverGirl in LA Simply Ageless Eye Concealer. And this stuff is usually, like, really expensive, but it was 75% off. So I thought I'd buy it. And I got mine in 220, which is, is it medium dark. Yeah, it's medium dark. Oh, sorry. Okay. So it comes with the, like two different colors, like a white and then the actual skin color. You just mix them together. I already used this obviously because I bought it for a vacation, but it's kind of dark. So like. I don't use it for under my eyes, I just use it as like a regular concealer because obviously you want something to brighten up your eyes if you use it for underneath your eyes. And then I bought this foundation which I don't really like because it's super thick and I didn't even test it before I bought it, like literally. It's so thick like it won't come out now. I have to like stick like a brush in there. It's a CoverGirl oil control one in medium white, 535 medium white. I got this because it said oil control and I get really oily and I wanted something to control the oil. I'm not a big fan, but CoverGirl was having a buy one get one 50% off deal. So I just ended up getting another foundation which I am in love with. It is the clean CoverGirl Clean Whipped Cream Foundation in 320. Yeah. So it's like whipped. It's kind of like the um, Maybelline Dream Mousse foundation which I had before. And yeah, it works really good. Like, I love this stuff. And you don't even need that much, so this will last you a while. So yeah. And then, the rest I got while I was on vacation. Okay, um... This video is going to be really long because I can't edit it. So, the first thing I bought... Okay, so my hotel was literally like rant. It was called the Wingate Hotel. Like, Wingate something. And it was like, you go up one place and it was a bank. And then you go up one more and it was Rite Aid. And I kind of love Rite Aid a lot. I didn't buy this at Rite Aid, but like, we went there a lot. So I got this from... Oh, I keep forgetting to tell you how much these are. So this was like, the concealer was like $3.25 because it was 75% off. And then this foundation was like $8. Which I, but I got it for $4. And then this foundation was $8.79. Yeah. Okay, and so from Target I got the um, e.l.f. Wet Gloss Lash and Brow Clear Mascara. And yeah. I feel like I'm going to be able to use both of them, the eyebrow and the mascara one. Because people usually buy um, clear mascara to use for their eyebrows. And so there's really no point. I don't know what you'd use clear mascara for. Maybe this is like, if you have dark eyelashes already, like put it on and like, so they'll stay, like hold a curl. But yeah, I bought that. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, and so at Rite Aid they had a deal where Physicians Formula was buy and get one fifty percent off. So one minute, I'm just digging this all out of my purse thing right now because that's the easiest way to hold it all. So they're having a deal is buy and get one fifty percent off. So it's planning on buying. I went there wanting a highlighter, and this one it's called. Happy Booster Bronzer, but like you can use that shade right there as a highlighter because it's really shimmery and it works really good as a highlighter. I use this shade, which I don't really use the middle part, but it's like in the shape of a heart. And this was a really good deal because it also came with like in a pack together for fourteen dollars. It came with the Happy Booster blush in natural, and this is really pretty. I love the hearts. And this one comes with... <sighs> Sorry. It comes with a brush. But I don't really like it. It's just really cute though. It has the on it because I had to use it. But yeah, I got those two things. They were supposed to be 
And then I bought, since it was bound to get one half off. Wait one sec. Oh, did the eyeliner already break? What? Well, the eyeliner broke, but I guess you can still use it. I bought this pack of three eyeliners. And it's like the nude eyes one that comes with a black, which broke, a brown, and a nude to look really good on my waterline. That one probably broke too. Okay, so I got those. But it was supposed to be $14. I oh know it was bound going free. And it was supposed to be $14 for those things. But they only charged me $7. So I guess that's fine for like everything. They charged me $7 because these were usually $12. Yeah, so the last things I bought are all lip products, and I've decided that I'm going to be with, like, lip products. I've always been into them, but I never really buy them. This piece of hair is annoying me. But, um, I decided, I'm like, for the fall season, I'm going to start wearing them more because I like them, but I never wear them. So the first thing I bought is the Revlon, first lip product I bought is the Revlon Lip Butter and Berry Smoothie. 50 very smoothly. And it looks like this. And it looks like that. It's on my lips right now. And that's a swatch right there. So yeah, this is really pretty. And this was like uh, $7 I think. I don't even know. And then the last two products I brought, bought were also lip products. And they're both um, the CoverGirl Smoochies. And I bought this one, the first one, in Too Cute, hashtag Too Cute. And it's like this color. It's showing really different. This is like a reddish orangey color. And that swatch is right there. And that one's really pretty too. And then the last thing I bought, and the last. What product I bought is hashtag text me and it looks like that. They're all pretty similar, but yeah, they're all really pretty. They look really similar in the camera, but they're not that similar. So thank you guys for watching and if you would like, can you request some videos down below because I'm kind of running out of ideas, but I kind of want to do a review on the CoverGirl Smoochies because I really like those and... Just let me know if you guys would like to see those. So yeah, thanks for now. I think I'm gonna ooh, I think I'm gonna go film July favorites right now. So I hope you guys enjoyed this and thanks for watching.